him and what they stole from other nations. He yes. got double portion. Yes. And the Bible says, and David called them David's spoil. So I want to encourage you. The battles of life is fierce and is getting fiercer the more. Getting tougher and tougher. Amen. Amen. So you too must learn to become tougher in, in God. The Lord will strengthen us in Jesus' name. Amen. I said the Lord will strengthen us in the name of Jesus. Amen. Don't give up in your service with God. Don't give up in your giving. Don't give up in your prayers. Don't give up. Because that is the air you breathe. A friend of mine, a family friend, we have known, that this is almost 16, 17 years ago. He was an assistant pastor in the redeemed then. And then suddenly he became wearied. Say, ah, Pastor Kola, I'm supposed to take digging deep. That is the Bible studies in the redeemed. I'm not going. I say, why? And you know his problem. He had one of his children that was physically challenged. They, not physically challenged. The child was sick and then they've been taking the child up and down. And I called him. I say, is it because of this child? You don't want to stop preaching. You want to stop serving God. Who gave, now, are you the owner of the child? Was it not God that gave you? You know, there is a way, he's, a, he's a, a, about two, three years older than me. There was a way I spoke to him. His head come correct. And to the glory of God, the same child is a graduate in abroad today. You will never know, uh, you, will, if, you will never know that that child ever had any challenge. Mm. And he too is serving God. Hallelujah. A few weeks ago we were talking, I said, if you have stop serving God then mm, mm, the child will have been what she is today mm, and most likely you will have backslidden you will have yes, gone for it. yes yes what shall separate me from the love of love God, of God. Mm. nothing Tabasha. nothing please beloved times are tough we know the Bible has predicted it but that is why I love Isaiah 60 he said you know, arise and shine, for thy light has come. The people God was telling to arise and shine, because there was darkness. So, how do you shine in darkness? You shine through the light of God. May the Lord help us in Jesus' name. Do not stop giving. I, the greatest joy I have is when I give. It gives me joy. Don't stop giving. Don't stop serving. Don't stop praying. The Lord will help us in Jesus' name. Heavenly Father, we thank you for your word that has come. We give you praise in Jesus' name. Amen. Father, we pray the grace to stand. The grace to, you know, to move closer to you at a time like this. Father, you will give unto us in Jesus' Amen. name. Lord, we thank you for your daughter you have used. We pray that you will refill and refuel her in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, mighty Father. Hallelujah. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise Congratulations, Sister Rosling. Thank you, sir. Amen. Amen. 29 years, you are still looking as if you want to just uh, <laughs> begin. <laughs> Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. The Lord will bless your home. Amen. Today, Amen. God will add new wine into that marriage. Amen. It will be sweeter and sweeter in Jesus' name. Amen. It's offering time. Let's get our free will offerings as we give unto the Lord. You have your tithe. Let's uh, come together. Or if you have paid yours already, can you just rise up where you are? If you have your tithe, let's come together. Hallelujah. Amen. We had Sister Evans' testimony. And that is the truth. I started tithe with 10%. One day I said, ah, God, this one is too small. I went to 15. 15, I went to 20. 20, I went to 25. The day I hear any one of you paying 25, I will go to 30. Me and you cannot. Somebody is there. Are you sure? I've changed my mind. Seriously. I've changed my mind. Hallelujah. And when I do that, God, God blesses me. I've changed my mind from today. Lift up your tight and appreciate the name of the Lord. Give God praise. Give him honor. Give him adoration. Begin to appreciate him. I want us to stretch out our hands towards these people of God. Father, we thank you for your children. They have come to honor you with their tithe. Oh, Lord, as they have honored you, honor them in Jesus' name. You see, when we pay our tithe, 
We will rebuke the devourers for our sake. You open the windows of heaven and bless us in such a way that we will not have room enough to contain. Let it be the portion in the name of Jesus. We cover your finances with the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. The Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Let's get our free will offerings as we give unto the Lord. Father, we thank you, Lord, for the privilege to honor you with the tokens we have brought today. We pray that, Lord, you will receive this and bless it back to us. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Now, before we take our thanksgiving offering, uh, let's quickly take some few announcements. By the grace of God, tomorrow, Monday, we have our prevailing prayer meeting. Now, by, uh, please, um, from October, we will come up with more. We need to pray the more. We need to pray. Praise the Lord. We need to pray the more. We need to pray the more. Uh, we will come up with some more uh, prayer strategies. The Lord will help us. I just have that burden that we need to pray. We need to pray. So prevailing prayer meeting comes up tomorrow, 9 p.m. online. Uh, God bless those who who, despite Zoom challenges, who are, have been able to overcome that challenge. So tomorrow, please, 9 p.m., let us all come together. The Lord will help us in Jesus' name. Tuesday, 12 noon to 1 p.m. is hour of mercy. One hour cry to God for his mercy. And Wednesday, 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. is our Bible studies. Please, now as she was teaching, you can't stop and ask questions. This is preaching. Bible studies is an interactive moment where we interact. Please, if I begin to plan for that one hour from now, you have month, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday to plan to give God that one hour. Let's come together. Let's share together. May God help us in Jesus' name. Amen. And on Thursday, 11.30 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. is our, our deliverance service, moment of solution. So, and on Friday, Friday 29th, this Friday is, our, is the last Friday, uh, is our encounter night. Hallelujah. Amen. And Hallelujah. please, this very Friday, we are coming to pray. We are coming to what? To pray. pray. So come and, you know, loosen up. Carry those bodies and come and drop it at the feet of Jesus. We are going to pray. It's a prayer night. It's a prayer night. So please, prepare yourself. 11 p.m. we are here. We will pray until God says he don't do. Amen. We will pray for ourselves, pray for the church, pray, but particularly we will address key issues. When we come together and pray, God will answer, and Amen. he will do so in Jesus' name. So please, Amen. let's come. I want to thank God for yesterday's evangelism. It was super fantastic. Amen. It was fantastic. Hallelujah. Praise Amen. The Lord. It, was, it was fantastic. So uh, please, if you are not there yesterday, begin to plan yourself towards the next one. The Lord will help us in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. So, Amen. let's quickly give our uh, thanksgiving. Let's appreciate. Get your... Now, this is thanks and giving. You are giving, you are dancing. You want to thank God that you saw me through the month of September. Rise up on your feet. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. We, we, we want to dance. Somebody tell your neighbor, say, we want to dance. We want to dance. Hallelujah. Somebody tell your neighbor, say, we want to dance. Hallelujah. Tineke namo ide bube oye ne mema. Ide bube agame tolo. Ide bube. Tineke namo na ide bube oye ne mema. Ide bube. Oh ide bube. Ide bube. Oh ide bube.